Today on Design, Build, and Fix, how to use components in SketchUp. Remember, if you like the content, make sure you subscribe to the channel. All right, let's jump right into it. All right, so now we're going to show you how to actually use the component here in SketchUp. Uh, component is actually a very, very powerful tool because it allows you to make one change to one part of the component and it changes every single other one. So for instance, if you're actually doing like columns for a porch or for anything and you want to make a change to one and it goes into all of them, all you have to do is change one and it automatically updates all the rest. So here's how this thing's going to work. What we want to do now is first make this a component. So what I'm going to do is just select the whole thing and then I'm going to right click on it and go down make component. And we're just going to call this, uh, we'll call it box. And I'm going to say OK. All right, so now I have my component. Now what we want to do is let's go ahead and make copies of this. So I'm going to grab the Move command. And I'm going to hit the Control key, which gives me the plus mark for copy. Then I'm going to come over here and drag it this way. And let's say we want it three feet apart. And I want 10 of these. So I type in 10x and hit Enter. And now I have quite a few of those copies of the component. Now here's the thing. Uh, if I want to make a change to this, let's say for example I want the top of this to be a different color. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to select it then right click on it and then I'm going to go to edit component and then uh, let's grab our paint, paint brush or paint bucket and let's make it this color. And if I select that surface, notice how it changes all of those. And then I can get out of that surface and you can see that that's been changed. Now I can actually do it for drawings. So I click on any one of these. Let's click this one and I right click on it. I'm going to go to edit component and let's say we want to put a box on here. We'll put it out here and then we can uh, push pull that out. And as you can see it updates on every single one and that's going to uh, allow us to change all of those all at once. Now one of the things that we can do is we can change one individually than all the rest. For instance, if you have columns on your front porch and you want to put numbers on one of these columns and you don't want to have to repeat it on all of them, you can actually just edit the one. So I'm just going to click on this and uh, we can come over here and go to, let's just, let's just put a circle on it. And we'll just call this a circle and we'll put a circle on this side. And then I can push pull it and let's push pull it all the way through like this okay and notice what that did is it changed just the one but not all the rest because I didn't edit the component all right so that's the component in SketchUp all right thanks for watching the component video hope you found the information in the video helpful and useful more videos coming out shortly and how to use SketchUp we are closing in on the end of it where the fun actually starts very, very shortly. So thanks for watching. And if you like the content, make sure you subscribe to the channel. All right, we'll see you on the next one.